Ladies and gentlemen, I have something very exciting to bring to the table today. I went to my storage facility, did the retina scan, the fingerprints, went down the long hallway where the lights come on as you're moving, opened up the atom vault. For some reason, everything's technologically advanced except for the vault itself. It's still one of those old school turn wheels. I opened it up and what's inside that graces me? Nothing big. Just some of the greatest movies ever created. And that would be the Water Wars film collection. All four films, written, shot, edited, acted by yours truly and my ragtag crew of friends, post high school, pre-college. These are some of the greatest works of art ever put to digital film and then put on DVDs, then transferred to digital, then downloaded, uploaded, downloaded, uploaded, downloaded, and finally I have them in my possession again and have remastered them, meaning I've taken the copy of a copy of a copy, recolored it, fixed some of the audio, fixed some of the editing issues, and I am today bringing them to Patreon and YouTube join members at the $10 tier. I know, I know, it's insane. It's absolutely insane that I am giving these away for $10. You're basically stealing them at that point. So if you are a Patreon, maybe only at the dollar mark, this is the time to jump up. You're getting four Water Wars movies for the price of fun. They're around 40 minutes each. Masterfully acted, of course. We're talking about high school guys from Minnesota that have never taken an acting class in their life. They're almost perfect. The writing is Shakespearean in level. And the film, the, the 4 by 3 shitty aspect ratio and crappy camera quality is really screaming to be viewed by every single one of you. Joking aside, I have a very special place in my heart for all of these movies. They were all truly written and shot by me over the course of just a few days each. My buddies were very loyal to a fault. To go on these journeys with me, spend their entire days and nights, and they're honestly some of my favorite moments in history. My brother's the lead character, Jake. I'm the villain. Kind of back and forth, depending on the movie. There's a, there's a lot of drama, a lot of pageantry, a lot of switching of sides. Uh, sticking with the plot is going to be a challenge on the no budget that we had. Things, things were cut, corners were cut, sacrifices were made. But for the most part, I look at these four movies and I think, you know what? <laughs> Good for you, dude. Good for you for doing it. You know, for getting out there, shooting some stuff, having some fun. Water Wars are silly, uh, stupid adventure stories about me and my brother and our teams trying to win glory, trying to take home the Water Wars Championship for one more year. This has been going on for several years. We're just, you're just kind of thrown into it when the movie starts. It's, all bets are off. These are obviously comedies. They parody some popular movies. 
I have a lot of fun with it. We all have fun with it. And hopefully you will too watching these movies. I would appreciate the support if you can give it. 10 bucks a month on Patreon. You can sign up and, and leave after one month and download all four of these movies if that's what you want to do. Fair enough. They're yours. Uh, hopefully some of you will stick around though because you appreciate the content and you appreciate the work I'm doing. And I also want to point this out. I like these movies so much. I mean, not in their current versions, but I, I like the idea behind them so much that it's really something I want to pursue going forward. I would love to see this turned into like a Netflix show or a movie of sorts because I'm seeing a lack of quality content. Again, not that this is quality content, but the idea of kind of an all-inclusive family-style comedy show that has the spirit of the 80s and 90s. Um, and it doesn't, it doesn't have any like agendas or bullshit behind it. It's just really guys being idiots trying to prove themselves to each other, and there's nothing more to it than that. <laughs> now, if you have been following my show for a long time, you may have saw these when they were originally uploaded to YouTube, but they've been removed and blocked in every single country across the globe because there's so much copyrighted music. I got Bon Jovi songs in there. I got music from The Matrix. It's all over the place, and there's no way to pull that stuff out and use generic. So there's no way for me to give you access to these outside of putting them behind a paywall. And um, I think they're worth it. I think they're worth 10 bucks for the four of them combined. The other fun thing about this, the last thing I'll say, is this, since I'm in Minnesota, we have very harsh seasons. We have a few nice, or I was in Minnesota, I'm sorry, I'm in South Carolina now, but I spent most of my life there. And when we shot these, I was in Minnesota. Very harsh summers, extremely long, crappy winters, a nice fall, a nice spring. It's all kind of mixed in, blends together for the most part, those, those nicer months. But... Since there's four movies, they all actually take place during all four seasons. So you got the first ones in the summer, second movies in the winter, third movies in the spring, fourth movies in the fall. And I even had fun with the names, uh, the titles of these movies. You got Water Wars. You got Water Wars Snow Falls, like a waterfall and also snow. You got Water Wars Cross Tides, tides as in water tides and jesse cross is the villain so there's a, a pun a play on words there and the final one is water wars dried waves not really much to that one but it, it's dry because there's another element introduced into that film and also because of the waves again i got lazy with the last one but whatever it's all there the four seasons collection water wars please support the channel and i hope you enjoy them let me know in the comments if you watched and what you thought take care